Hi friends, welcome to my channel Lotus Geek. Today we're gonna fix an error. Your device is offline. Please sign in with the last password used on this device. The very first thing, or the very first step you need to do is to remove your device from the Microsoft account. For that, open web page either in your phone or any other desktop you have. You can open this web page in your phone also. I'll provide you a link of this website in the description below. Simply copy this link and paste it in your browser. Over here, under the devices option, you will find your device, your laptop or your computer. You need to click on it and then remove that particular device. I do not edit any device. That's why it is showing that we don't have any devices for you. But at your end, it will show you your computer device. You need to click on that device and then remove it. This one is the first step that you need to perform. Now come back to your PC, which is showing you your device is offline. Please sign in with the last password used on the device. Now press and hold the shift key and then click on this turn off icon over here and choose the option restart. Make sure you hold the shift key and then press the restart option until your system restarts. Now you are welcome with this screen once you restart your system. Choose the option troubleshoot and click on advanced options. From here choose command prompt. Now in command prompt type reg edit and hit the enter button. It will open the registry editor for you. Here locate a file in H key users, expand it, dot default, again expand it, software, again expand it, Microsoft, then again expand Microsoft. In Microsoft, find identity CRL, again expand it, and find store identities, again expand it. Here under store identities, you will find your account or your user account keys. Whichever key is causing you the error, you need to right click on that particular key and click on the delete button. Now close it and here type the exit. Now go ahead and choose the option exit and continue to windows. Now this time go ahead and try to enter your windows password. This time you will be easily able to log in into your system. That's it you have to do in order to resolve for this particular issue. If you still face the problem, kindly comment below so that I can provide you more ways for the resolution. That's it about it friends. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to like and share my videos. Thank you friends.